Okay, sorry, nag-stop yung video. Uh, okay, nakurap yung file. Okay, so dito, kanina may kamera tayo ng problema dito. So yung previously dito na 2, hindi ko na-distribute pala yung 3. Kaya na kamera dito ng 6. Okay, so ito magiging minus 2. So pag plus 2 mo dito, so ito magiging na 4. Okay. So, ito magigitong 4y minus 4 thirds times y squared over 2. So, ito magiging uh, 4 times 3. Okay. Minus 2 thirds 3 halves. So, cancel na natin ito. So, ito magiging 12 minus 6. So, area natin is the same as the computed dito sa vertical strip natin na 6 squared units din. Okay? So, as long as nag uh, mapakita nyo na nagtatouch yung uh, given curves natin, uh, madali nyo ma-identify kung horizontal or vertical strip yung magamitin natin. Okay? So, let's proceed with the second example. Okay, here. So, wherever we have this one. So, find the area of the region binded by the curve y is equal to 9 minus x squared and x minus uh, x axis. Okay. So, identify again muna yung curve. So, yung first curve na given natin is a parabola. Okay. Ito okay, yung x-axis natin is again y is equal to 0. So, line. Okay. So, first thing kailangan ma-identify nyo kung paano i-graft yung uh, parabola natin. Okay. So, so, y is equal to 9 minus x squared. So, isolate natin x squared. Lipat ko sa kabila. So, equal to 9 minus y. And, kailangan uh, using ko siya sa standard form. So, negative y minus 9. Again, yung ginawa ko dito is nasa uh, review nyo ng conic section na chapter 7. Okay. So, ibig sabihin ng vertex nito is at 0 and 9. Okay. So, ibig sabihin, ito yung uh, magiging uh, point kung saan mag-open yung parabola. Then, mag-open siya. Since yung x yung naka-squared, ibig sabihin, mag-pass through siya ng dalawang beses sa x-axis. So, negative. So, ibig sabihin, downward. So, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. So, ito yung point na yun. Tapos, uh, pag gano'n yung buka niya. Okay? So, para makuha yung point of intersection, substitute natin yung value ni x-axis na y is equal to 0. So, yung point of intersection natin. So, substitute natin si y 9 minus x squared and y is equal to 0. So, 0 is equal to 9 minus x squared x squared is equal to 9 so square root natin so si x is equal to positive negative 3 so ibig sabihin dito magpa-pass through mag intersect yung dalawang line natin so 1, 2, 3 1, 2, 3 okay. mag draw natin yung curve ok Iksabihin nyo yung parabola natin. Ito yung uh, y is equal to 9 minus x squared. Yan ito yung area yung pinapanap sa atin kasi ito siya mag enclose Okay. Point of intersection is 3, 0 and negative 3, 0. Okay. So dito, yung case na to, uh, pwede natin gawin is uh, vertical strip. Okay. Kasi pag horizontal strip naman yung ginamit natin, 
itong curve na to is the same curve lang siya. So, yung right minus left nyo will yield 0 value. So, kailangan natin is vertical. And, pag nag-vertical tayo sa isang side, nalabawa dito lang sa side na to. Um... Yan, pwedeng yun na yung maging solution natin. Okay. So, ito is dx, y. So, ang area natin is equals to y dx, a, b. So, yung limits natin will be from negative 3 to 3. Then, yung y natin is upper minus lower. Yung upper natin is ito. So, 9 minus x squared. Lower natin is yung x-axis which is y is equals to 0. Dx. So, a is equals to negative 3, 3. So, 9 dx minus x squared dx. Taking the integration of that. So, 9x minus x cubed over 3. Negative 3, 3. So, is equals to 9 times 3 minus uh, 3 cube over 3 then minus 9 minus 3 minus negative 3 cube over 3 okay so this will be 27 meaning squared minus 9 minus negative 27 um, so negative positive 9 so this will be uh, 18 minus so ito will be negative 18 oh wait okay, negative 18 times negative so plus 18 so ang area natin is 36 square units Okay.